Here's my um, Dollar General haul. <laughs> Listen, it looks like I was just like out surfing and scraping the barrel, and, and I was, look. But the best thing I did come out with with this oil of Olay, the simple oil of Olay, it smells so good. It's soap. I'm really not a, a soap user. I'm all over the body wash, but I'll be using this for a gift to somebody because it smells really nice. And then, and then the dollar snuggles, they only had one, and I actually found that. <laughs> That's hilarious. And I had planned on getting like seven or eight of them. I had about that many coupons, and I thought I was rolling. Uh, well, uh, they didn't have um, that one. All the rest of them were two dollars, and I and I knew that from early part of the week, and I was going to go to a different Dollar General, and somehow I end up down there for whatever reason. I guess because that was along the way to my mom's house and everything. I delivered my mom's package today, which it grew. <laughs> it grew from the time last time I showed you that I had set out things for her. I end up giving her more stuff. So I'm happy about that because less money out of her pocket is awesome, awesome, awesome. So here's what I did. I used the $2 uh, overlay coupon off of that. I used the 50-cent coupon off of the Snuggles. I used the 50-cent coupon that Renee sent me from California because mine was a quarter. So I used the one from Renee. Uh, I used um, the $2 air wick, you know, off of two products, and these were a dollar. And then this head and shoulders is $2.50, and I, I use that. And it's the Danger Shampoo Plus Conditioner. It's a little shorty bottle. And I, I, there's no way you can call this a travel bottle because it's larger than what you can bring on the plane. So you would end up leaving this. Uh, you would have to leave it with the airlines because it's a little 6 ounces, 6.8 ounces is what it is. And the coupon had no size restriction on it. I kind of looked at that. And then these are Gillette razors, and they were three fifty, and the coupon was three dollars. And then I went to my mom's house. Well, I was at my mom's house, and the guy was coming in with the red plums, which I have over there. And so a fifty cent coupon was in there, so that cost fifty cent. And then a hefty. I know we had coupons for those, which I think we did. I I didn't feel like going back to the car, and that cost two dollars. And then uh, I bought a grippy thing. Usually you line your shelves with this, but I'm gonna line a flower pot that I have. Uh, cheap way out. Instead of uh, buying a new flower pot, I just line this and then put some more dirt in there, and we rolling. One dollar is what I paid for that. So everything you see here, all these items you see here, which seems so random. Well, it kind of not random. It's more like I'm all about that bathroom, right? <laughs> the hygiene, personal care stuff is what it looks like I have here. And uh, everything you see here, I paid four dollars and twenty. No, 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 no. Tax. My subtotal. My subtotal was four dollars and. Uh, thirty six cent and my tax was a dollar twenty nine. I paid five dollars and sixty five cent for all these items here. Five sixty five. And and I used their five dollar coupon and of course they want to keep you going coming back. So they give me another five dollar for next uh week on the second and the third. So I don't know. And unless Greg, that dude, come up with some scenario, I kind of looked on what he had from last week on one item, and some of the stuff I really didn't want, and then I thought I was going to get the Zest. For some reason, I had in my mind that Zest coupon was $2 off body wash, but it was a dollar. And where I'm getting that $2 from is because Kmart was doubling your dollar and making it 2 but no, it's $3, and I did not want to pay $2 for body wash. <laughs> I know. Oh, well, I didn't. <laughs> I did not. It didn't fit in this scenario anyway. This worked out okay. And if I, I don't know how I could have went a little lower because I was trying to figure that, and I just couldn't, unless I would have got more air with, but I didn't know how the coupon was going to work there. So I just stuck with the two, and if I would have got another air wick or even two more, if I'd have got six or just two more, that would have worked out. So since I couldn't figure enough now, I'll just let that roll. So that's what I got. This is Dollar General. Dollar General. Dollar General. All right? 
Just want to share it with you and let you know this is what I got today. Thanks for watching my video, and I'll be watching you watch me. Here's the breakdown of Dollar General. And as you can see, um, Dollar General takes that $5 and splits it between all the products that you purchase. So as you can see, um, that uh, Hefty Meals, which is uh, paper plates, was $2, and it uh, subtracted out $0.37. Cent. Something was a dollar or fifty cent, and it subtracted out eighteen cent. Eighteen cent. You see how it's forty-seven cent, sixty-six cent. It does that until I don't know what, what uh, item price or how it decides it, but it um busts up that five dollars among everything. And so there's my total there. Subtotal was four dollars and thirty-six cent. Uh, tax a dollar twenty-nine. Five sixty. Five and save twenty dollars, and then of course, oh, I got a survey this time. How about that? And of course, they give you five more dollars to come back the next week. <laughs> Thanks for watching my video, and I'll be watching you watch me.